I would like to explain and uh, display our instrument counting and organization system. This system replaces the standard stringer, which is a very time-consuming and lengthy operation to thread every instrument into the stringer one by one. Our system eliminates that. Another stringer that is commonly used is this stainless steel stringer that goes through one side of the instrument rings while the other side is open. You can see the instrument get tangled up and messed up and they cannot stay in the open position and they may lock accidentally with some pressure, rendering the instrument non-sterile. Our system is an instrument counting and organization system. It's a rec with instruments that contain 15 instruments with 15 number slots. The way this is done very simply is in the instrument room, the instrument technician deposits all the instruments one by one into each slot. They then lock the instrument with the stainless steel wire and they can raise it then to handle the instrument. Our L-shaped stringer replaces the standard stringer and in very few seconds you can go through all the rings, make sure the instruments are open and put the stringer into the hole on the side of the instrument, making it safe and in the open position. Those trays can go into the sterilization trays where the instruments usually go. You can also pre-attach two units together for 30 instruments as well. When the instrument tray is opened up, the first step is to take the L-stringer off. To make sure you don't lose the L-stringer, we have an area with a couple of snaps here to contain the L-stringer so it doesn't get lost. You then move the wire back and the instruments are ready to be handled in the sterile field. You can have another empty one on the Mayo back table and you can move the instruments into a reusable system as, as, it's, it's, as it is done here or a disposable instrument organizer that can take all the instruments on the Mayo from the back table. At the end of the procedure, actually, all the instruments are deposited back onto the trays, one by one, in no specific order. You just basically want to fill all the gaps and all the slots. This assists in the counting of instruments. As an example, if you started a case with 30 instruments, two full trays, and during the procedure, you can actually count the number of open slots, like here, one, two, three, four, five, six open slots. The rest of them are full with instruments. In this case, it will speed up the instrument count. If your hospital policy allows you to do it, this method meets the ARN recommended standards for instrument counts. Instead of counting five Edsons, five Kelly, five Mosquitoes, which is time consuming, you can actually look at the missing instruments in the slots and then look for them in the field. And you can basically detect four instruments, let's say on the back table and two instruments on the Mayo and you basically counted six instruments instead of 30. That shortens the cycle time of counting the instruments uh, two or three times during the case and uh, assists in the quick turnover of the surgical suite. Another important feature is the safety feature. If you had a sharp instrument on the rack, you always handle the instruments from the back side away from the tips as OSHA recommends. By handling the instruments from the backside, 
you don't take a chance to be pricked or injured by the sharp instrument. The instrument tips also can be put inside a wash basin to keep the tip of the instrument moist uh, following the procedure uh, on the way to the instrument room if uh, necessary uh, for cleaning purposes at a later stage. Before the instrument uh, rack is organized again for the next surgical procedure, the instrument technician has to organize the instruments in the specific order with the count sheet of five headstones, five kellys, five mosquitoes, etc. It is also important to note that uh, the length of the instrument life will be extended because the instruments are not going to bang each other and the tips will get uh, damaged. This system is safe, secure, and will save cost of instruments as well as turnover of surgery and sharp injury uh, for the staff. Finally, uh, it is uh, very cost effective and it uh, meets all the necessary instrument criteria of cleaning, washing, sterilizing, ultrasonic uh, cleaning, autoclave, as well as uh, any other uh, disinfecting uh, type procedure and chemical sterilization. Thank you very much.